how to make a user registration form in WordPress. Hi guys, welcome back. Today I will show you how you can make a user registration form in WordPress. So let's get started. You want to create a registration form in your WordPress website and you're looking for a free plugin. Well, you're at the right place because today I will show you that how you can simply add a user registration form, a professional form in your WordPress website very easily and for free. So let's start with the process. What you have to do is simply open up your dashboard for your WordPress website, whatever website you want to add the registration form to. Now. What you have to do is simply scroll down to plugins. In plugins, go to add new. In here, I want you to search for. So what I want you to do is simply search for Forminator. This is a plugin that allows us to create different kind of forms. This is the plugin right here. Forminator, contact form, payment form, custom form builder. In here, we can actually go ahead and create our registration, user registration form as well. This is a pretty good plugin and has more than 2 million active installation and more than 800 five-star reviews. So what you have to do is simply click on install now and then click on activate. Once you activate your Forminator, you will be able to find it right here under settings. Click and we will be able to create our own user registration form. So this is our plugin right here. And in here, we will be able to create our user registration form very easily. So let's start with the process of creating our form. In forms, you will be able to find the option of create click on create and now we have to choose a template so we have a blank template that allows us to add a you know everything from the scratch we will add different fields and then we have contact us we have quote request and then we have registration form right here so i will simply click on registration and continue so now you have to enter a name for your user registration form so i will simply add test in front of it so i will have an idea that this is the test user registration form click on create so this is our you know template for user registration form so in user registration form this is where people will be able to register for your website so in here you can actually go for different things you have a username of course then we have an email to sign up and then we have a password if you want to add another field to your user user registration form let's say you want to add a phone number address you want to add website you want to add captcha and then you want to add a stripe currency whatever you want to add but you know i think the sign up form should be very easy so we are going with a username email and then we're going with a password I'm going to actually go with a capture as well just for, you know, a spam check and I will insert this field as well. So now we have this right here. We have recapture and then this is going to be the capture capture settings right here. And I'm going to simply go ahead and these are the different fields that I have added. Now I have username, email, password and capture. So if I click on any of these fields, then I will be able to customize it. Um, th these are the settings for this field, like required, username is required. Then we have an error message. Um, we have maximum characters. So if you want to go with characters or words, you will simply add them right here. So if you want to add repopulate, you can simply add it right here. So then you will simply click on apply and it will be applied to this. Then we have email email in email again go to settings this is optional or required you will simply choose and uh, then we have other settings once you're done with the settings click on apply then we have password so the password is also you know an important part of registration process so we have minimum password strength so this is actually important that what kind of minimum you know password strength you want and i want people to have a strong password so you will simply you know add the settings right here then we have required course a password is required and i will simply click on apply then we have capture of course where people will be able to you know tell if they are a robo or not so these are the uh you know uh, fields and then we have appearance in appearance i can simply go ahead and change the appearance for my user registration form i can simply go ahead 
ahead and you know change the uh, uh i can change the font i can change the color I, if i want to add a custom css i can add it as well then we have user registration in user registration um this is what we have we have username we have email first name last name or website so this is like a you know basic um a name that they have added like mad out mapping like this is what you can actually create this is an example that they have given to you then we have an activation method if you want to add an email if you want to send a link to their email then you you will simply add it right here if you want an email uh, activation if you want a simple activation then it depends on you how you want your um, you know uh, user registration to work then we have behavior in behavior we set different settings such as how this form will react if it's a submission behavior right so what will happen after the submission then there is validation uh, then there is autofill option security lifespan and others once you have added all of these different information you will simply uh, go to email notification as well so in email notification you will find the email that you have added for your wordpress and this is the email where you will be getting different notifications on your you know wordpress whatever is happening on your website you will get a notification uh, every time a person will register themselves on your website you will be notified so then we have integrations and settings once you have created your form your user registration form that was super easy to do you will simply add your fields whatever you want to add click on preview and we will be able to check out our user registration form so this is a an example that they have given me you can you will be able to add any username you want to then you will be able to add a an email whatever email the customer or client will have they will set up a password and after that they will click on register and they will be able to register for my website so let's go ahead and add so now you can see right here they will simply click on register and they will be able to do so so this is how you can also simply go ahead and create a professional user registration form very easily on your wordpress website so yeah guys this brings us to the end of the video i hope that i was a big help to you and now you know everything that you wanted to know and don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if this tutorial was a big help to you i tried to tell you everything about the topic and i hope that you understood everything and now you are good to go and don't forget to uh, share this video with your friends and family members so they can also get the information they want to also you can subscribe to the youtube channel the button will be given right down below go ahead and subscribe to the youtube channel also hit the notification bell so every time you get notified when we post a video so yeah also leave a comment down below what was your favorite part and what did you learn from this video or if you have any question this brings us to the end of the video i hope that i was a big help to you and now you know how to add a user registration form to your wordpress website don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to the YouTube channel.